What's up, what's up guys? So today is day after the challenge. Uh, it's Saturday, July 18th. And it means that uh, today I will just eat kind of whatever I want. Have a little cheat day. So now I'm heading to Tim Hortons to get some coffee maybe and of course some donuts because I haven't had a donut in a very very long time so yeah I, I will show you today everything I eat it's I, I don't care today you know I just wanna enjoy myself and yeah I'm glad it's over so sit back relax and enjoy this video <laughs> All right, so goodies acquired. I got myself some light iced cappuccino, uh, but it tastes very sweet, so I don't believe it's light, but whatever. <laughs> and three donuts, and when I get home, I'll show you uh, which donuts I got. So I'll see you back home. All right, I'm home. You know, I need to change my shirt because I was sweating and this is my home shirt. I wear it all the time, my favorite. So uh, I got Boston cream, my favorite, and two new dream donuts. One is Oreo donut and the second one is peanut butter jelly donut. So I will eat them. This is my snack. Uh, because I already had a pre-workout meal that was just uh, egg whites and oats and yeah now I have a cheat snack so yeah uh, I'll give you a taste test of uh, each donut and yeah that's gonna be it all right so first donut is Oreo donut I don't know, so let's give it a taste test. Well, that's how it looks. It's kind of, it's not bad, but kind of boring. The dough is pretty dry. And I yeah, can taste the Oreo, but I'll give it six out of ten. Six out of ten uh, Oreo Dream Donut. Not bad, but kind of, as you can see, the dough is, I don't know, it's weird, weird texture. So that's Donut Numero Uno. Next thing, next donut actually, we've got is classic Boston cream, my favorite. So I know how it tastes. I'll just give you uh, inside look. So mm -hmm. oh wow, there's a Boston cream. Solid, very solid. Nine and a half out of ten. Not the best, best donut, but certainly my favorite. So, favorite one, Boston cream, nine and a half out of ten. Still drinking my iced cappuccino. Almost done though. But yeah. I will enjoy this one. Okay, and lastly, we have is another new donut, peanut butter and jelly. So you got some peanuts on top. There looks like there is a cream. Let's see if there is a filling inside. I don't know. I have no idea. So let's give it a taste test.
I mean, we are Peter by the way, but I haven't found the jelly. There is a little bit of jelly, but mm -hmm. one more bite. Yeah, it is. Mm. Oh wow, look at the layer here of peanut butter. Yeah, that's a solid donut. Yeah, this one is nine. Nine out of ten. I think it's very calorically dense because all the peanut butter and peanuts on top. But hey, I don't care. I've been in dieting 90 days, so I deserve this. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this one is good. I'll enjoy this one and that's gonna be it for my little, well, for my snack, for my cheat snack, so. And then, I don't know, I'll go for a walk and see what, what do I want next. So stay tuned. Hey guys, so as you saw on the screen, uh, I'm having this monstrum baguette and uh, it's a whole bread loaf well i don't know it was not a loaf but it's a huge sap bread just a huge bun so i'm having this as my dinner and this is i don't know it's for me this is a this is a perfect meal i love this meal i wish it you know it's a the whole bunch of bread so it has a lot of calories but i just crave bread so much i i love bread so for me this is a healthy cheat meal and yeah i'm excited and i'm starving it's wow uh 1930 you can see and yeah uh last time i had eight uh i had those three donuts and a coffee so i'm starving and this meal will put me into coma i think so yeah very excited i will give you uh just not a taste but one one bite and then i will enjoy it by myself with some with some YouTube videos and but oh man oh man look at that it's look at this thing oh my freaking god you know if I wanted to buy it, it this thing uh, cost me like I don't know five bucks in total and there is the same exact thing in the store you can buy and it costs 12 dollars i think so perfect and i think this is less calories because i used uh, sugar-free ketchup low uh, miracle vape and ham you know fat-free cheese so well i was talking and just give you Oh wow. <laughs> hmm? I don't wanna show you much but this is what the inside looks like and yeah I'm just freaking tomatoes just juice everywhere. Alright, this is my next meal. Maybe I'll have one more snack which I bought in the store and yeah uh, so hot in here but i've enjoyed this and i'll see you in the next meal i was actually craving this more than a pizza because pizza in this weather it's no not a but not app appetizing so i'll eat this and i'll see you next meal <laughs> Hey, I have like one 
fifth left, one quarter left, and I have to take a little bit break because very very filling. Uh, I don't know how many calories uh, is in there. I didn't count. Well, I didn't weigh anything. I just put some ham, cheese, and there's yeah, some you know, the miracle. Whip. I don't know how many calories, but I don't care. Uh, today is my post competition day, so I just don't care. But that's why very good, but very filling for. Uh, I, I'd say it's it has thirteen hundred calories, maybe less, but mostly from the bread. But like I said, I don't care. I don't count calories today, uh, so we'll just finish this later. And yeah, <laughs> I just wanted to update you that I'm I'm struggling. My stomach is not as it's not stretched enough. So uh, I've been eating a lot of veggies, but you know I'm I'm not used to uh, this amount of calories anymore. <laughs> so I'm struggling. But yeah, I'll in or take a fifteen minute break and then finish that. Yeah, just an update. I'll see you next meal or next clip. Hey guys, welcome to the next uh, snack. Just I pick up this. Apparently, it says new uh, Kit Kat chunky bar. Never had this flavor. Cookie. It says cookie dough. Kit Kat cookie dough. So I saw it. Never had it. So. I picked it up, so I'll give you a live uh, taste test. So, okay, one square. See how it looks. Yeah, David approves. Yeah, I do approve. This is how it looks. There is a little wafer, uh, and there is a cookie dough cream filling, whatever. Ah, very good. For 280 calories. What the hell? It's small. Three little pieces. Well, yeah, so that's my another snack. I don't know, uh, it's 9 pm. I don't know if I'm gonna have anything. Yeah, I'll probably have uh, something else that I picked up. I wanna try that, and today I can. So I'm not really full. I'm I'm alright, yeah, but that sub was pretty, pretty nasty. But yeah, this is my next snack, and I will see you later. Hey, what's up, fellas? So, I'm about to have my last meal, uh, which I bought before, and I will end this cheat day like this with. I got sushi, spicy California rolls uh, with crunch on top. So uh, yesterday's sushi was awesome. So I was craving sushi as well. And as a dessert, I never had this thing uh, in my life before. Uh, carrot cake. So. I don't know, uh, never had it, don't know if I like it, don't know if I'll eat it all, 
We'll see how we feel, but this is gonna be my last meal, I guess. Yeah. So I'll give you a taste test as well, and that's how we finish our cheap day, I guess. <laughs> and by the way, why uh, this? <laughs> it doesn't look very appetizing. It's so messed up because I. I bought it and when I bite a bike ride I carry stuff in my backpack and I got more stuff so I just smashed it but you know I don't care uh, taste wise it won't make a difference if it's smashed or beautiful okay so I get my soy sauce here but first I will try it of the soy sauce so spicy california roll first bite <laughs> not bad pretty good actually but smoked salmon way way better but yeah, uh, uh, I'll try one for you with the soy sauce. Oh, kind of spicy actually. But I I have never tried sushi, and I think this is gonna be a staple. Okay, a little soy sauce. Mm. Yeah, better with soy sauce. So yeah, uh, very good. Not as good as mm, smoked salmon, but still good. I'll finish that and then yeah, eat the carrot cake. So stay tuned. Alrighty, sushi done. Now we've got the carrot cake. Uh, sushi, like I said. It wasn't bad, but yesterday's was pretty, pretty good. Uh, okay, now let's give this a go. Okay, bye. Wow. Oh, wow. I'm a fan. Very tasty. Very tasty. This is how it looks inside. Just carrot cake, I guess. First time trying it. Not bad. So. Very good. I'll finish this and then uh, end this cheat day here. Uh, well, it wasn't really a real cheat day. I had some bad meals, but you know what? One day of uh, bad eating, cheating won't make you fat. Uh, so as uh, one day of healthy thing won't make you lean so yeah i definitely mm, enjoyed this day and i have no regrets because i bored hard during those 90 days and now i will just work continue to work hard uh, not in the diet phase but I wanna main gain and just get better at gym, but that's a topic for uh, maybe for this video as well. I'll have a, maybe I'll add a little talk, you know, if you will. 
but yeah right now I enjoyed this day uh, it was a hot day uh, I was very active and yeah I think I ended here so I'll finish this cake and I'll see you know next time bye hello guys today is Sunday July 26 uh, it's my off day from the gym so I'm on my way to get some coffee as usual and today it's one week for after my diet so I want to show you uh, how I look uh, what my current weight is and I want to talk to you about my upcoming plans with my diet and nutrition, training and stuff, so uh, that's what I'm gonna talk about and today, I don't know, it's a beautiful day outside, as you can see, the sky is just pure blue, it's 9 a.m., yeah. Good, so I'm on my way to get some coffee and then I will just talk to you about my, my plan. So stay tuned and I'll see you in the next clip. Alright, so let's talk about uh, this week and my upcoming plan. So uh, today uh, I weighed in at 161.4 the same weight as yesterday and uh, I'm looking like this if I compare it to uh, my last week it looks like this and yeah there's a <laughs> slight difference but not a lot I gained uh, since the show day I gained two pounds three pounds and yeah it's mostly uh, water and uh, this week I was I was still uh, tracking calories I, I had a cheat day at on Saturday then on Sunday I ate normally um, I had a few few snacks I, I think I had a slice of pizza and maybe something more uh, yes yeah, so a bit of ice cream but yeah, uh, and then from Monday I, I was counting calories again, but uh, I, I ate around 2400, 2500 calories. I wanted to see how my body reacts to a decent amount of calories and how it looks, <laughs> etc. So, yeah, and now I'm maintaining my weight so that's perfect so i will be uh, still eating like this but i think i'll count calories for uh, my next next week and then i i wanna try uh, intuitive eating because i I wanna take a break from counting calories and weighing everything and I just wanna I need a I've been tracking calories for three years straight you know almost every single day so that's kinda I don't know it's not bad but you know I I don't want to do it anymore I don't wanna do it for the rest of my life so I wanna Mm, listen I want to learn to listen to my body uh, and just this is this is my plan uh, at least in Canada uh, I'll be here for another six months so in those six months I want to practice intuitive eating and I didn't want to do it uh, straight right away after after the diet I don't want to do it because I still have some cravings and not not a lot of cravings but I do have some cravings so I didn't want to do it right away 
So now I will track calories for another uh, week. But yeah, then I will go to intuitive eating and I will try to just master it. I, I, I will still eat healthy because that's, that's what I like. I enjoy my uh, diet, but you know, I, it's, it's not a reason to have a box of cereal every single day. But you know, if I want to have a cereal, I'll just, it's, I don't know. I will, I will just listen to my body, you know, not uh, emotional hunger, but internal hunger, but I want to try to listen to my body, but, you know, like, if I want to eat, there might be a slice of pizza and, you know, I, I can have a slice of pizza. I won't have the whole thing, but I will have a slice of pizza and just see, I will still monitor, I won't wait uh, food, I will still, but I will still wait myself and uh, try to be around, well, my goal is not to get over 165 pounds, I wanna be, well, I wanna be close to 165 pounds, you know, plus, minus, one max two, two pounds because uh, when I was 165 pounds uh, I looked like this and I think for the summer it's a perfect perfect uh, look and I was feeling I was feeling great so yeah uh, I think I'll I will try to be around 165 pounds but also, I wanna listen to my body, but uh, my body uh, naturally it wants to be heavier. I don't know. I, I wanna I wanna try it for myself because uh, I don't wanna count calories in the future, and I just wanna be more. I am flexible, but I wanna be more and have uh, now uh, if I eat and I just you know I don't know how to explain it but for me I I created some I don't know mental damage I don't know but uh, when I eat food I still count calories in back in my head and I I'm just uh, you know obsessed with with calories and numbers and you know, when I go to a restaurant and eat with my friends, I just look at the meal and in back of my head, I just, I trying to figure out how many calories is in there. And now uh, with that, I just wanna uh, take a mental break from that and just, you know, don't care and just listen to my body and yeah, if I eat, uh, if I'll get over 165 pounds and just, you know, gain weight quickly, I will, you know, re reduce and try to, you know, maybe count calories again. I don't know. But yeah, that's, that's my plan. And uh, mostly what I will focus on is I wanna, I wanna main gain, so stay around 165 pounds and get stronger and bigger in the gym so i'll be uh, tracking my weight my uh, gym weight you know when i lift weights so my main focus is to uh, build muscle and i wanna improve uh, my physique but you know I don't think it's uh, intuitive eating and you know just having a goal building muscle in the gym is a good thing but also maybe it is because I will get a little bit of mental relief and I'll just focus on, on the gym weight and 
and mostly I want to enjoy the rest of this year here in Canada so I want to try their foods and uh, not just count everything you know and not wait everything because it's just I don't know I, I want to take a break from it from it in general so that's my upcoming plan and well I, I think that's it I just wanted to share that with you and I'll do in terms of YouTube and videos I wanna I wanna uh, learn how to cook uh, different meals you know uh, how to bake uh, some do some healthy recipes healthy baking recipes healthy donuts healthy cookies and pies and pancakes and yeah i want to just experiment you know make some good food maybe uh do uh more food f you know even for my roommate yeah. so yeah i just wanna do i don't know you know make a bunch of food and just don't care if it's you know this amount of calories or that amount of calories in that portion I just yeah i want to cook for my roommate as well and just yeah i want to get better at it and uh i want to film a recipe videos and i'll do some i don't know maybe eating challenges so we'll see yeah but this is my upcoming plan uh, and I think that's it for this video. I think it's a long one already. And I didn't wanna make this uh, long video, but yeah, uh, this is my weekly summary, upcoming plan. So I'll finish this here. So thank you uh, very much for watching and I hope you will uh, stick to my channel. I hope you just uh, enjoy these videos and if you do just give it a like, comment below what you wanna see, what content should I create, you know, educational videos, just, I don't know, something, just give me some ideas and yeah, uh, so subscribe to the channel, uh, give it a like and yeah, I think I'll see you in the next video. Bye.